I'm going to make a crock pot peach cobbler today. It'll be a small one just for two people. It's really easy to make in a crock pot. You just throw everything together and let the crock pot do all the work. You want to start out by spraying the inside of the pot with separating spray there. The main thing that makes it easier to clean and then throw in about a half a stick or a third of a stick of butter. Then you put that in the microwave about 20 seconds to melt it. Then you open your can of sliced peaches and drain all the juice into a bowl or a mixing cup or whatever you want. And the butter's all melted. And just dump the peaches in on top of it. Got a half cup of liquid off the peaches here, so I want a quarter cup of sugar and one tablespoon of the baking mix. This happens to be pancake mix that I'm going to use on the crust. mix that together. And dump that in the juice. And whisk it together. And you want a little vanilla extract in there, if I can get that lid off. Got the lid off and pour about a little less than a teaspoon of vanilla extract in. And beat that up. Then pour all that back in with the peaches. Next you want a half cup of baking mix. You can make your own or you can use it. Pancake mix, which I'm using here, or Bisquick, or biscuit mix, or whatever you want. And about a half of that amount of water. and make it up. You want to, well I see I'm going to need more water than that. This, you want a rather thin batter like you do for pancakes. Got this batter here just about like you do for pancakes. It pours nice and pour it over the top of the peaches. It'll go down in them some, but it'll come back to the surface when it starts cooking. And finally, hit it with some cinnamon. And that's it. Put this on the crock pot on high. About three hours should do it. And here it is after about three and a half hours in the crock pot. It's done. It's ready to take up. 
The thing about it, though, I think there's a law in Texas that can't, you can't serve peach cobbler without bluebell ice cream on top of it. It's a good thing I have some. And here it is, steaming hot with a dip of ice cream on top. Can't get better than that.